This week has been tough. We were working very long hours, putting the final touches on the telethon. But then I got this in the mail. It's from my best friend Haley in Winnipeg. So the card says, this is to celebrate your induction into the sisterhood of crazy cat ladies. <laughs> One thing about this experience is that it really reminded me I am more than my job and you know I should come home and just be present, enjoy the moment and enjoy life with these ridiculous kittens living in the room next door to me. Okay, oh, and he jumped out. This is the last time I'm taking them for shots. I don't even know how I'm going to carry them back the next time because they might be too big to all fit in. So once the shots were done, the care attendants brought the kittens out and uh, they spoke with me. They had noticed Luna was quite a bit more underweight than the other two. And essentially now my job is to make sure she does fatten up and that the feet are separately. But, you know, whatever it takes, we'll make sure that Luna is healthy and strong and ready for her new home. Very soon, Jameen is bringing her son to meet George, and he has no idea. Baby, do you remember how you always wanted a pet? Do you still want a pet? Do you? Open the door. Okay, you see that little one right there on the yeah, it's yours, the little orange one over there. This one right here. Yeah, that's him. That's your new kitty. Yeah. And these are his this is his sister Luna. And this is his brother Fred. Brother Fred. Nope, just no. one. <laughs> We're just going to have this one. And I like the cat. Cats that are orange. And see them to snuggle with me and my mom. <laughs> I can't wait for them to find new loving homes because if they can make such a big impact being as small as they are right now, oh, I don't even know what kind of damage they'll do as lifelong companions. <laughs> Only crying. <laughs> <laughs> Those are not supposed to be like this. <laughs> I'm very happy to be adopting Tonks, or Mama Tonks as her new name is, and uh, I want to thank everyone who has and thank continues to donate to the Saskatoon SPCA. Without their donations, I wouldn't have been given the means to care for these animals and to give them the healthy start in life they deserve. And of course, I wouldn't have met my new best friend. 